Hey, it's time for Last Night in the Loco on WHHI, powered by Loco Sports. The top golfers from independent schools in South Carolina converged on the Hackler course at Coastal Carolina University on Monday and Tuesday for the Skiza State Championships, and a pair of teams from the Loco found themselves battling for the trophy. Hilton Head Christian Academy took an eight-shot advantage into Tuesday's final round and withstood rival Hilton Head Prep's best effort over the final 18 holes, hanging on to edge the Dolphins by two shots for the team title. The Eagles finished with a two-day total of 581 with individual champion Sage Bradshaw firing a pair of 68s to lead the way and finish one shot ahead of teammate Gabe Schmitz. The Dolphins and Eagles also went head-to-head -head on the soccer pitch last night with Prep's girls blanking HHCA 4-0 behind a pair of goals from Ashley Brothers and a goal and an assist from Caladando. But the Eagles earned a split with a 2-1 overtime win in the boys' matchup. The region champion Buford High boys continued their hot streak with a hard-fought 2-0 win over John Paul II, and Grady Lamb delivered the game winner in overtime to lift Buford Academy past Palmetto Christian on the road. JP2 had a good night on the Diamonds, though, as the baseball team routed Coastal Homeschool 14-2 and the softball team beat Battery Creek 9-6. And the curtain has closed on the cross season in the Loco after May River's magical run to the semifinals ran out with a 16-7 loss at Lucy Beckham last night. For Loco Sports and WHHI, I'm Justin Jarrett. Until next time, go Loco.